about a year and a half ago, there was no COVID, right? At least it wasn't in our country at the time. We didn't really have to worry about it that much. Then when it came in, everybody was scared. Everybody went and bought all the toilet paper, right? Then they said, you don't have to wear a mask, it's okay. Then they said, you must wear a mask. That's when they started infringing on our rights. That's when that First Amendment right of the freedom of speech was taken away in some form or fashion. But the people that were in, quote, power said, no, that wasn't infringing on our freedom of speech. So then we were stuck wearing masks, those that wanted to succumb to that. The government told us we had to do that. My family, just a, a little bit ago, we did have COVID. And it took me about two days to get over it. it. Took my daughter about two days to get over it. it. Took my wife about two weeks to get over it. We're not here to say COVID does not exist. It absolutely exists. Now, vaccines, when did those start? Polio, we eradicated polio. I hope you all agree with me on that. Vaccines have their purpose. Vaccines are important. There are certain things that they do to keep us safe and protected. But you know what they told us with this vaccine for COVID is that you wouldn't get COVID if you had it at first. Then they said, you might get COVID. Then they said, you could pass on COVID even if you had the shot. Then we have studies in Israel where they say, you get the shot, you're gonna get sick anyway. You just might not die. I had COVID. I don't think I'm dead.